Good boy. How's it going, Tai Tai? What are you doing? Huh? What's going on? What's up? Good boy. Sit. Good boy. Come here. Shake. Hey. Shake. Shake. Ty, shake. Shake. Oh, now you're not going to do it. What are you, camera shy? Huh? Oh, I see how it is. Anyway, guys. Now I have a dog in my lap. Oh. Say hello. Go lay down. Good boy. Anyway. I went to Goodwill. And I picked up a Dell Optiplex 760. For seven dollars and fifty cents, and then a Dell keyboard for another two bucks. Um, I've been asking them to please put systems out on the shelf for a while because uh, they stopped doing it. They're under new management, and they have a new guy in the back that's stripping down the systems and whatnot, and also selling them on Goodwill's online um, website, kind of like eBay. So they haven't been stuffing out there, but they finally stuck like four of these babies. Uh, out there for me. Uh, sadly, they are Core 2 Duo is not the Core 2 Quads, but I picked one of these up for a specific reason, and that is I have a Core 2 Quad Q6600 uh, that can go into this. I also picked out the best one of the bunch. Now, they took out the RAM, uh, which is kind of disappointing, and I don't know if this board is DDR2 or DDR3 based. I think this is DDR2 on these particular boards but uh we got a wow 80 plus silver rated power supply with wattage i haven't actually seen one of these with uh an 80 plus silver rating max output power is 255 watts so 250 watt power supply a little dusty um nothing i can't take care of it's got a video card in it. This is the only one that had a video card, but it's Dell's stupidly proprietary connector that I just now realized that. Um, hmm, I might have to go back up to Google and see if they have the connector for that. Because that's annoying. Um, I wanted to test out this video card to see what it might be. I'm guessing like a Radeon 5750 or 3850, something low powered. Um, damn, that sucks. I don't want to order an adapter for this. Anyway, um, Core 2 Quad, I believe this one doesn't have it labeled what it is. Probably around a 2 point something gigahertz. Um, no hard drives. It has not been cleaned by the looks of things. It's all dusty. But uh, I don't see any bloated caps which plague these, specifically these caps right here in this area because it would get the heat from the cooler and the heat from the north bridge and it would cook those caps and then the heat from the video card and there's no fans back here to help that out. So, um, yep, well, I'm going to have to do some digging online, probably order some RAM. Um, does it say... Whether or not those are DDR2 or DDR3, I'm going to guess it's DDR2. And I actually have uh, two sticks of 512 meg DDR2 in my room. So I'm going to go grab one of those and I'll be right back. Okay, so there's a 512 meg stick of DDR2 in there. So this board is indeed DDR2 based. Um, I'm going to go on eBay and see if I can get a decently powerful single slot video card, uh, a hard drive, and 8 gigs of DDR2 RAM, and uh, we'll make this thing into a budget gaming PC. Let's see how much it costs to play the most modern titles, or at least as modern as I own, and uh, go from there. But anyway, guys, I shall talk to you later.